with Sarah and I have had a crafty weekend so far these are some buttons we played with clay last night Friday night yeah um I had made this when I first started playing with clay I made this little birdie and I guess this has been my style of birdie um, for a while and I forget you know but it's this little kind of teardrop shaped bird and anyway I decided to try some buttons and I haven't actually put them um, <clears throat> on a project yet like I was thinking <clears throat> eventually or when I make a few more faux dories, I think I'm gonna put them on the elastic on the stretchy the stretchy elastic that goes around the faux dory and it's just another added um, little thing that I made so these are a bit bigger some like I love this one this one is such a sweet size and <clears throat> Joe actually made these we were Maya Joe and I <clears throat> um, we're just playing with some clay she made if you know she was making what she was making I was making this and Joe was over there and he started slapping canes together I don't know what what he you know he just started doing it with random clay. He wasn't really looking at colors and stuff, but I mean, I think they turned out really super cool. So, anywho, uh, <laughs> I like this one. This was, so this was scraps that, you know, were on the table and I just made a bird out of that. But I, I love the pink and orange. I'm really into pink and orange at the moment. This was just some more scraps. Um, scraps. But aren't they cute? So we're gonna see, well I will see how the buttons look. I really like the blue ones too. And I put some of my flowers on there, my little flowers. I think they look cute. So that was that, I did those. Those were my first attempt at buttons. So now I kinda know where I'm going with it. Um, I got in the mail these um, tags they're from I guess I got them on Amazon and I got four packs it's kind of tricky the way you order them um, they're cheap but you you don't get to pick which ones you're getting they just send you random ones and I mean these are cute I got a definite good assortment because I want to make these page flags and I am still struggling with magnet I ordered um, <laughs> a boatload of magnet this is all magnet sucks it doesn't stick it's um Mar marietta magnetics flexible and neodymium whatever i got it on amazon um i guess they're on ebay and etsy um and it was wonderful shipping and reasonable price but the magnet isn't strong this is supposedly for like you can make a sign on here and stick it on a car or something and you know it does stick to the refrigerator and everything but it won't stick to itself like when I try to put it this is it right here like it doesn't hold so I'm really frustrated um, this is actually working better this is just the regular craft magnets that you get at Michaels but they're still not strong enough so that was frustrating because I want to laminate a bunch of them I was gonna put these in pocket letters and everything and I I'm waiting on magnets that'll work but this is my what I made today look how cute Let me go up a little. you are my sunshine and it is I think I forget how big these are let me see I have another pack that is 16 by 12 12 by 16 um, <clears throat> so it's big so you can see my hands compared to it while well, my 8 by 10s are over there I just love it I used um, this stamp set and it was on clearance and I've had it in my stash forever but I was crafting with someone today <clears throat> And instead of drawing out your own things, I thought we would just play with these. And this is just what came to be. And we used a little bird like the one I used in my um, previous canvas. And I wanted to do You Are My Sunshine. And I had my little faces, so we made a sun. And I used the Tim Holtz um, 
the stencil with the the rays going down and oh my gosh I, we just had so much fun and there's like a little bu uh, butterfly I used the little bugs from um, the uh, lawn fawn bug set and then these are just I just made little heart flowers and I think it turned out super cute I am loving these I use very few colors so it's not a lot of colors and I didn't do a lot of even background stuff to it um, kept it real simple but I like the bigger um, size of it and I did use the um, pearls again like if I turn it I don't know if you can see but there's pearl paint on everything highlighting it and it just adds shine and it's so cool like I love it I actually am gonna post this on Facebook it's so cool so anyway that is what I've been doing so far this weekend. I think I might do some more canvases because I'm just really enjoying it. Um, and I think I might make some more buttons because they're super cute too. So, all right, you guys. Thanks for watching.